Where's my mask for sanding? There it is. Even when you feel slow, you can still go. Even when there's no hope, you can still go. I never answered a no, man, I still go. Go, 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 go. Alright, welcome back to another video. Today, I'm going to take off the hood, fenders, bumper, and kind of mount those over here on the wall so I can do the finish body work on them, get them ready to paint, and then I'm going to be painting them separately than the car anyways, so I might take the side skirts off, not too sure yet. All right, this might be a little tricky by myself, but a couple bolts here and a couple on the other side. Let's get this hood off. And these bolts are 12 millimeter. All right, well, got the hood off. Wasn't too bad. Still kind of a heavy hood. Maybe I'll just run this thing without a hood. <laughs> yeah, so now I can do Final body work on the hood. Make sure everything's straight and good to go. I'm actually gonna bolt something to the wall. I'm gonna make some little brackets that the hood bolts to. That way it could swing up and then uh, either have a support pole underneath or have something hanging to hold it up. That way it's a little bit more flat. All right. Now to take off the front bumper and then the fenders. All right, yeah. Maybe just run it like this. Ultra cool. Now a smart man would have marked these bolts on both sides before he took the hood off. That way it was a line when he put it back on. I don't have a brain. Moving on. All right, now we're gonna take the fenders off. All right, got the fenders, the hood off. So after I'm done doing the body work and getting the fenders ready for paint, I'm going to be putting this board across the shelf and then bolting the fenders on there. I've done this before, it's pretty slick. That way when you're painting, you can get a pretty good, pretty good coverage and it's solid and ain't gonna go nowhere. But as for the hood, I was gonna do like hinges and bolt it on there, but I'm just gonna get like a table small table to put that on that way it's flat just make it easier so same thing with the side skirts I'll have this wood board going across so I can just bolt them up there and then paint them that way all right well while I'm waiting for uh, the rest of like the spot putty and supplies to finish the body work I'm going to clean up under here a little bit more now with the hood off I got better access back here I'm gonna take off this cowl here and paint that because just for the hell of it yesterday I painted the grill it was looking kind of ratty get a better look at it looks freaking brand new I went with the flat black and then the satin clear. Same paint that I used on the brackets and stuff under the hood. But yeah, it turned out pretty cool. I'm still gonna be changing the grill eventually because this thing's got a broken tab. It was like that when I got it, but. So 
Same thing with the bottom grill on here. Eventually, hopefully if I can get a good deal, I can get, to get a different uh, front bumper for it. But for the time being, I'm gonna paint that part, the center black, and then get the, the grill that kind of has that same honeycomb design. Get that to match. And I'm still wanting to do the, uh, the air intake in the vent. All right. Got the board screwed down going across. I'll put a fender up there to show you where I'm gonna bolt it at. All right, well, got this contraption built here. Got it bolted to the bottom so it's nice and firm. Bolted on top. Yeah, that thing's pretty solid. Can do the finishing body work, then paint it while it's pulled it up here too. I got the hood over here. So then same kind of concept when I do a side skirt, I can bolt it going across there. Let's do one at a time. I don't think I have another board long enough. So either I'll do the side skirts up there or I got like a little stand kind of thing. So when I paint those parts, obviously this car I'm gonna have pushed over farther to this side. So then I can do the bumper and then still have the fan back there venting out. Got all the ceiling all the plastic and stuff up. Insulated pretty good. All right, well I got the car moved over here. I can still move it over another foot or so. But got the uh, fenders mounted. Hood over there, the bumper. I got plenty of room right here, do the side skirts or the bumper, set that up or like right here. All right, well, I think I'm gonna end it here, make this uh, part one. Waiting on stuff now. The rest of the supplies to finish this, so stay tuned for that. Make sure to hit that like button, it really helps the channel out. Subscribe if you haven't, and I'll see you on the next one.